Alrighty, hello, hello, hello everybody. Welcome back to a stage production that you can attend to for free with unlimited seating, but you get what you pay for. Tonight's production is going to be the first 
the premiere stream of Final Fantasy 13 2. Again. <laughs> um, for those of you who were here with me last time, you would know that um, I attempted to do this beforehand. Right after finishing up 13 1. And um, it didn't go so hot. <laughs> Now uh, there were fucking technical issues beyond all imagination. So had to kind of find another way, and that other way is a little bit more expensive, but I guess I was willing to take the hit. Um, and you'll see in just a minute. But for those of you who do not know me, my name is Beastcat, or Robert, depending on how you want to address me. I am the streamer, I'm the player, I'm your particular guy to this particular playthrough of this particular game. And as always, I am tonight's MC running this show solo. Um, just before, I'm going to wait for the stream to actually start before making any major announcements. Because even with this new setup, I cannot be sure that the stream won't crash. Because Streamlabs takes a lot of resources. But we will see. So, that's what I look like. This is the face that you're going to be seeing when the camera is available. Um, we're going to be doing a physical copy. Physical copy on the Xbox 360. So I actually had to go and buy the DLC. Which was not, which is not great, but I I have no guarantee it's gonna work either. So, you know, we're gonna find out together. Either way, I'm going to skip the opening cutscene only because of the fact that I'm going to skip the opening movie only because the opening cutscene Continue Continue Oh Okay This is my test file Christ almighty. So realistically, all of this should be unlocked. Like in all reality, all of this should be unlocked. Because I bought kind of the bundle. But for some reason, it's still saying I have to buy these. So we're going to find out. And we're going to play it by ear. So without further ado, we're going to be going on easy mode, because I'm a sissy. And I will see you guys on the other side. Enjoy. Yes, 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 autosave. That time was lost, yet time continued onward. Divine Etro, go peacefully to your rest. I will stand guard over your legacy. with sadness. Life and death lose all meaning under the rolling waves of chaos. Valhalla. The currents of time do not touch its shores. In the 
this world of lost moments, I begin my life anew. This eternity, it was never your desire. Is that not so, you? Alright, so, I'm going to skip it actually, um, because we're just going to auto battle through all this. Yeah, starting off with quite a, an introduction there, we see returning character already in light, who for some reason after saving Cocoon from crystallization is now here in Valhalla. Um, and it seems like there's an all-out war going on be between the forces of Valhalla and we're going to call them the Force of Chaos. Not 
not kidding around, huh? But it is very impressive. Like cutscene cutscene wise and just like how the game looks, it looks fantastic. Um Unfortunately, in terms of audio-wise, it still doesn't know whether it wants to be loud or soft, and I feel like I'm just going to have to constantly be dealing with that. Like, the cutscenes are super loud, but then when you get into the game, it quiets down. <clears throat> um, and I thought that that little audio glitch was a part of the Steam version for some reason, where, like, the audio quality just dips in the actual gameplay, but no, apparently not. Apparently that's just part of the game design. Well, not the game design, but, like, that's what happens in actual game, which is weird, because I never noticed that before. Okay, time for, uh... Time for 30 FPS. Which I should probably actually dip my stream limit to 30 FPS next time because I have a feeling that's what's using a lot of the resources here. Now, time for uh, quick time events. Like, if I could quickly. Oh boy. If I could quickly, like, shut down the stream and switch out the bitrate, then I would definitely do that, but it doesn't... It would start a whole new stream. I don't know. Maybe I'll do that after, uh... After we're done here in Valhalla. Because I know for a fact this game only caps at 30.
I was not prepared for the button matching that my choices would would uh, lay out for me there. But I do appreciate the fact that the, the, the cinematic actions here, the QTEs, is not literally just a button prompt. Sometimes you do have control over what the what the characters do, and that affects how the cutscene plays out. I appreciate that. Oh. Etro's gate. More story. Of course. The one from the vision. I know your name. No, Christ. What? <gasps> so again, now we've seen... We've seen the Shiva sisters. We've seen Odin, and now we're seeing Bahamut. She seems to have access to, like, most of the Eidolans in the last game. Most is an, an exaggeration. About half. Quickly! What in the... I'm here! Where am I? Valhalla. You prayed for a miracle, and that brought you here. Or am I wrong? How did you know? From Valhalla, I can see everything. But who are you? Lightning. This is the prologue that never ends. All right, let's go. Time for a real fight. Look out. Here it comes. It's fine. It doesn't mean anything. He misses. Gotta love auto battle. Mega flare. We did it. I'm not going to get anything from it, but we did it anyway. It was basically just spoon-fed to us. How do we fight him? This is not your battle. There's something else I need you to do. What? Bring my sister to me. Her name is Sarah. Okay. You'll need to use the portal. Your time-gazing friend should have told you how it works. That's a gate? But why me? Because you're the only one who can. You crossed the void and made it to Valhalla. You can find Sarah. And together, you can change the future. Wait. I can change the future? Yes. Give him to Sarah. 
Sarah. All right. You got it. I'll track her down. What's happening? Enjoying your little chat. Go with you, Noel Christ. Become an arrow through time and speed your way to Sarah. Be there for her, because I no longer can. So, uh, welcome to Final Fantasy 13. Even though they had a decent enough ending for th uh, 13 too, is that even though I had a, a decent enough ending for 13, they decided to start a new storyline with the same characters, and Lightning fucking dies! The one returning character that we have, and Lightning fucking dies! <sighs> Time flows without pause. In a world where I no longer exist, the future is about to change. Sarah, the truth still survives, but only you. Remember it. For one reason or another. Lightning. She was fighting. I guess it was just a dream. Everybody panic. Everybody panic. All right. Cool. Let's see. That's fine. Standard is fine. <laughs> I said yes, it's fine. And adjust the camera settings anytime. Yada yada yada. Again, this is fine. And I move to open the door. Data log! Same as the last game. <clears throat> open the door and head outside. Okay, so that's immediately not good. Unless. Hold on.
the items. Mmm. Fuck. Well, well, we'll get to all this in a minute. Oh, hold on. Okay, no, no, it did, it, it did. Okay. So at least my purchasing did, did actually work. That's good to know. Unfortunately, so unless it, it doesn't appear until afterwards, um, there's supposed to be a little bit of a, of a bonus when you load up this game with Final Fantasy 13 save data. And I, I know that there's 13 save data on this, on this console. I did a save data transfer, but it should still be there. Um, but I don't know, maybe it's. Maybe it's it's not reading it for one reason or another. Even though I checked. Whatever. I'm freaking out over nothing. I'm going to be right back. I'm not sure if this is going to count as the same stream. Or if it's going to be in different streams. So if it's the same stream, no worries. If it's different streams, especially if you're if you're on YouTube, I will label this one like prologue or whatever the case is, and then we'll we'll start from here. I'm gonna try and mess with some settings to uh match the game so i will be right back <laughs> 